Before we get started, I want to show you guys this tree. It's so fluffy. So I was really excited to take you guys to this awesome lake. My truck ended up getting stuck about a mile back on this super snowy road. I thought I could make it, but you can see the road here and the snow is about four, five feet deep on top of the road. So I've been hiking for the last mile or so. I think the lake is just around this corner. Let's keep our fingers crossed. I did a poll on Twitter a couple days ago asking which phones I should test in my next video. You guys voted for the Galaxy S7 Edge and the Lumia 950 XL. We're going to have a flagship Android phone versus a flagship Windows phone. Both of these phones are completely stock settings. Everything is on auto because we're going to do a video test between the two of them. We're going to start off with the 4K, drop down to 1080p, do the front facing cameras, and then finish off with some slow motion. So the things you always want to look out for are the image stabilization and the color quality. Both of these cameras, the Galaxy S7 and the Lumia 950 XL, have the OIS image stabilizing on the rear cameras. So both of these 4K images should be pretty stable. The Lumia 950 XL also let me enable some digital image stabilization, which is the same thing as that EIS that the Nexus 6P has. It takes that OIS, the hardware image stabilization, and doubles up on it with the EIS. We're going to take this 4K image and zoom in on those snowmobile tracks up at the top of the mountain. That's pretty insane. Remember that both of these cameras are mounted to the same rig, which will give us that same stabilization on both of them. Here's some close-up of the rocks. One more thing we can check, the white balance as we move up to the clouds. a little lens flare in there. So now we're in 1080p. Usually the phones have a little bit better time stabilizing while we're doing this, which is perfect because I'm walking in snow now again. So we'll check the image quality as I'm walking. We'll run for a second. Found a cool rock for us to look at. It seems like the Lumia 950 XL tries to go in and out of focus a lot more than the Galaxy S7. So now we're doing the front facing camera. The Galaxy S7 is going to be a little bit bigger of an image, but the Lumia 950 XL, even though it's shooting in 1080p, does give me the option to do an image stabilizing digitally. So we'll see the kind of quality between the two because the Galaxy S7 Edge doesn't have any image stabilization on the front facing camera. So it might not be as good as say the HTC 10 with the OIS on the front facing camera, but at least it has something. It'll be interesting to compare these two when they're back on my computer at full quality. I'm probably the only person on this mountain for literally 20 miles right now. I don't think there's anybody else anywhere. For the slow motion test, I was going to get in the lake and flip my hair like you see all those girls do at the swimming pool, you know, in those Instagram pictures. But then I realized two things. One, the lake is frozen. And two, I don't have any hair. So I got to think of something else to do for that slow motion test. For the slow motion, the Galaxy S7 shoots in 240 frames per second while the Microsoft Lumia XL only shoots in 120 frames per second. So the Galaxy S7 is gonna be twice as slow as the Lumia. So with double the frame rate, we're gonna to have to give the slow motion win to the Galaxy S7. But not everybody uses slow motion. Like I mentioned in my last video, beauty is in the eye of the beholder, and that's where you guys come into play. I'm going to leave a poll up in the corner that you guys can answer and say which phone was better, the Microsoft Lumia 950 XL or the Galaxy S7 Edge. And then leave a comment down below why you think that camera did better. Take into effect the color, the stabilization, and the overall quality of the camera. I'm going to go ahead and hike back to my truck and hope that I can wiggle it out of the snowdrift that I'm stuck in. So while I'm getting my truck unstuck, you guys should check out my Nexus 5X versus the iPhone SE video and my HTC 10 versus the Galaxy S7 Edge video. 
And if you're super bored and I'm still stuck, you can check out the durability video for the S7 Edge and the Lumia 950 XL. I've done durability tests on them both. Thanks, Dumb, for watching. See you again in the next one.